Table Ninja 2 delivers effortless multi-tabling across multiple poker sites. Betting hotkeys simplify the entire check, bet, call, fold process. With Table Ninja 2, you can play your entire session of poker without ever touching your mouse. New tables will always open exactly where you want them and the size you want them. Switch from tiling tables to cascading tables to stacking tables with a single push of a button on your keyboard. Table Ninja 2 will automatically check your time bank when you've run out of time and will handle cash and tournament annoyances like rebuying and cash games or closing tournament registration pop-ups. Table Ninja 2 even has a heads-up display showing general game information like your stack size and big blinds, how many tables we are playing and how long it's been since we've needed to act. Basically, Table Ninja 2 is a multi-tabler's dream. I'm going to set up and demonstrate the features I just showed you, but there is so much more that Table Ninja 2 has to offer that you'll just have to try it for yourself. Let's click the Hotkeys tab and show you the basics of betting hotkeys. Hotkeys let you press a keyboard button to perform an action. These are all 100% customizable. The main hotkeys used when playing poker are bet, check, call, and fold. Customize those hotkeys here. In this example, B will bet, C will check, call, and F will fold. Now the table must be in focus and it needs to be your turn to act for these hotkeys to work. The up and down arrows on your keyboard currently adjust the bet amount, but you can use your mouse wheel to scroll bet amounts too. And if you really want to automate betting, explore the betting tab where you can automatically set bet amounts for specific situations. Play some play money games to get familiar with how all this works before playing for real money. Let's go ahead and set up a table layout so tables always open where we want them. We do this in the table control section under layout. Click edit, then select the layout you want to set up and click edit one more time. In this example, I'm setting up the tile layout and when I save the table size and placement on my monitor, all tables will tile based off of this single window. Use these hotkeys to switch between different table layouts. The other layouts I'm going to cover basically stack tables. When tables are stacked, tables requiring action always come into focus at the top of the stack. Now, Table Ninja has a set table aside feature too, so you can remove tables from the stack allowing you to focus on specific tables away from the stack. Maybe it's a monster pot that's going down and you want to follow the action closely. Cascading Tables stacks tables in a way that lets you view the window title bar on all tables that are currently open. Stack and Multi-Stack lets you stack tables in a single area or two areas for the multi-stack. And then Ninja Tile takes stacking to a completely new level. In Ninja Tile mode, tables where you have called or bet preflop are moved out of the stack and placed anywhere you want them. This lets you instantly see all tables where you have put money into the pot. Now that we have some layouts set up, it's a good idea to head over to the pop-up menu and set up a table frame color. This way you will always know what table is in focus for your betting, calling, and folding hotkeys to work. The final feature I'll cover is the Table Ninja HUD. Click the Display tab. Now throughout this video I've had my stack size shown in big blinds, the number of seconds since I've needed to act, and my open table count. You can add and remove those HUD elements here. Adjust the position of your HUD elements on your table by clicking and dragging the HUD elements here. And of course, you can change the font size and color down here at the bottom. Use Table Ninja 2 to maximize your hand counts when grinding. With Table Ninja 2, you will be playing more tables with less effort in no time.